Good morning, guys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Alyssa Hokola, and I am a South African actor based in Johannesburg, South Africa. I'm back with another vlog. And yeah, today is just like a daily vlog, a day in my life sort of thing. And yeah, join me and welcome. Um, I just want to say thank you to my subscribers, uh, the notification gang. Yeah, yeah. I see you guys all the time. The people that comment, you guys know yourselves and I love you so much and I know you guys. And I just want to say thank you. Shout out to all of you guys in the comment section. You guys actually um, make this worthwhile you know um every time i think of vlogging i think of you guys so thank you thank you thank you thank you and to everyone that also watches my vlog whether you subscribe whether you don't subscribe whether you comment whether you don't comment the fact that you are watching also means a lot to me you know and there are people that are actually watching my stuff so i really really am thankful for that um yeah so i just had my workout sorry i couldn't um work out with you guys but you guys know how i work out i've vlogged the workouts for you guys so now um i'm about to do the dishes tidy up the house you know and then i've got a box and unboxing to do i just got a package from take a lot ah, i'm so excited you guys so yeah um, just join me all right see you guys just now Hey guys, so I'm done tidying up the house, washing the dishes as you guys saw, and I'm about to go shower now, and then we'll do the unboxing. Alright. Hey guys, so I'm done showering. Um, this is, <laughs> I decided to take my Duke and make it my top for the day. I think it's cute, uh, and it's pink. Anything pink is definitely my favorite. So I told you guys that I'm going to unbox so my those are my trilogies. Um I told you guys that I'm going to unbox so this is from Take A Lot. Um listen, I don't know what's in here. Reason why is that because me and my husband always order and we get we always order Me and my Me and my husband always order separately. So we don't know what the other one ordered so you wouldn't know if you're opening his package or your package but i'm praying and hoping and me i believe that this is my package and um whatever's inside here i believe i need now i'm just joking you guys i bought uh, a wig 
remover because this wig has been on my freaking head for almost two weeks now and that's not okay because i think they said it lasts a week so i tried to take it out with water i didn't do my research when i did that but as soon as i did my research i realized that i have to buy a wig remover so and you can only get a wig remover and take a lot because i went to clicks so many clicks they didn't have uh, wig removers i also realized that my knowledge with wigs is so yeah i'm starting to get into wigs and stuff like that so i'm excited uh to unbox this and whatever tools are in here are the tools to help me uh with my wig installation journey so must we open it yes what else oh one thing also that irritates me about wigs is that fudge brah there's hair everywhere in the house like i have natural hair back in the day when i had an afro like you could see hair but like reasonably now with the wig like it's a bit too much guys like there's hair on my husband's side of the bed there's hair like in my husband's things there's hair in the bathroom there's like hair everywhere i don't know if it sheds or what happens but that's one thing i don't like about um wigs scissors and then like <laughs> take a lot also like it's giving you guys like giving us all of us actually um like big boxes for small things you see this big box find this like the small tiniest thing inside yes it is what i think it is it is what i think it is You always look at people when they're doing their wig stuff and think it's... I told you guys about the box, right? So it's usually a big, big, big box. But I think I'm going to need this box in like a month or two. Where am I going to put it? Anyway, guys, give it up for my good skin. Hey, boo. Thanks to Skin Institute. Okay, so here I got myself... Hair press comb. Apparently, you need this if you're a rich girl, so that's exciting. And then we got wax stick. Uh, this weekly treatment is so concentrated, just a small amount is needed for hair to become soft and lustrous <laughs> i think that's the word lustrous and shining in minutes this is a bond invisible bonding for poly and lace systems oily scalps what is a high ham dry heavy perspiration see i need to like learn a lot about wigs and finally the wig remover I'm excited about the wig removed. I don't know how much we remove the wig together, guys, because I want it off. I really want it off. I miss my freaking micro locks. I miss seeing my little hair. And I miss, like, you know, water falling on your head in the shower. I miss that. The wig doesn't give you that. Directions for use. Spray on adhesive area. Reaction time is up to adhesive buildup, which is as short as 30 seconds. Wipe residue off with soap and water. Okay. But to spray, but the bottle is not a spray bottle. It's this kind of bottle. Maybe I don't need to spray it. But let's remove my wig. Give me a second. 
I'm just so excited about the stuff I got you guys. Okay. I'm gonna check something on YouTube first about removing your wig. Just keep a cotton pad close by. I don't know why, but let's do it. Okay, I'm gonna go to YouTube quickly. <laughs> Guys, this wig is a good wig. Don't see it like this. As soon as I spray water on it, huh, it looks like I just came from the salon. Let's uh, wig remove. So now I have this, just the face cloth, it's really a simple face cloth, warm though because that's why it's got steam and then we've got an alcohol spray and then we've got the wig remover and we've got a little pin to help us, so let's do it. Then I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use one Also, you don't want your hairline gone, guys. Gang on, gang on, when we are there. Gang on, gang on, when we are there. Gang on, gang on, when we are there. It's coming off, guys. Oh, my hair now is getting all this oil from this I was actually washing my face after this place. Well, it's mighty good for my hair. Guys, can you guys see I'm too toned? <laughs> Really, almost all my hair's gone.
gonna go wash my face, ladies and gents. What a morning, what a morning. Hi guys, I just did a workout and then I realized Ubuti has not let me go out to the stores while I give the lady who helps us in the house um time to you know to clean up and whatever. I don't like I don't like being in their space when they're working, so I was like it's cool, let me just um go do my thing. Plus I needed to get some stuff from Click. So I'm going to do a clicks haul for you guys. These are stuff that I usually would get at clicks and some of the new stuff. So we got got to be glue for screaming mold, guys. Um, so I got this because as you guys know now, I'm a wig wearer, Isn't it? a wig wearer, <laughs> I wear wigs now and, um, I'm starting to collect my stuff so I can do proper things when I install my wig. And then we have, of course, oh, I took the wrong ones. I took the wrong ones cotton pads i like the ones that have like a secured thing on the edge these ones are quite open um let me show you guys how open they are you see these i like the ones that the ends are secured sort of like there's a thread situation that happens here but when they open like this i don't like that but seeing what you know, have to use them. And then this is a new fave. It's a, a muscle ease uh, foam bath, mainly because we gym so much in this house and like our bodies are usually so, so it's nice to go into a bath with like some tea tree, some salt, some nice stuff in here to ease your body. And then as you guys know, I, I said it before that I used the Woolworths shower gel. I went to Woolworths like a couple of months ago and they told me that they're slowly discontinuing it. So I was like, why must I use a brand that I know is going to like still continue to use a brand that I know that is going to finish soon. So I was like, it's fine. I also love Dove and I like Lux. So at the moment we're using Lux um, and I like this as well. Um, I love the pink version of, I forgot what sort of flavor or whatever blend this is, but I like, um, Dove products in pink, these pink ones. I look for what this one is exactly, you know, but this is nice. I bought this, I got lotion this is the lotion we usually use with my hubby ah there it is it's what this is coconut milk i guess it's coconut milk but i got these as well uh so when i'm in the bathtub i love using these and then i got this lip ice for my husband he's got a thing for his mouth that's in his bag so i got this for my bag um mainly because like sometimes when i ask my husband do you have something for the lips and i usually have a lip gloss so i don't usually have vaseline or whatever so i'm gonna have this um like i have his asthma pump in my bag like i have an extra asthma pump for him in case he needs it also why do i have these things it's because i don't like not being of help to people you know when somebody goes and you live in the same house with that person and they go oh, my asthma pump you were there you could have just taken it or you could have just had it in your bag or i just don't like not being of help i like being of help i like when somebody goes oh i forgot then i went hmm i have one in my bag that's just me and then um i got some laundry detergent um the the washing machine we use here at home uses these cubicles kept capsules <laughs> capsules so and i'm enjoying them and they have 
this long lasting fragrant smell that like lasts for a really long time and like when you're doing laundry and then you you hang your laundry on the balcony and you leave the door uh open when there's a breeze that freshness smell comes into the house and the house also smells fresh um i got these uh funny story about these um as so i was using an uber today as i'm waiting for the uber to come at the mall there the security guard says to me um because obviously you can see these through the bag i had because i didn't have my usual shopping bags i just took this clicks bag fine he says he doesn't like these things so i pretend like i didn't hear him so that because then he repeats it then i'm like okay i have to listen to him he says that he doesn't like he doesn't like the sight of 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 uh pads then i'm like okay why oh i was like oh okay and he's like yeah in his relationship it's a problem firstly it bores the sh sorry lord it bores it bores me when men want to complain about periods you know like i don't like it let's talk about periods periods are normal they are things that happen to a girl you know like they're normal they're not a dirty little secret they're not and you as guys don't have the right to not like them we only have the right to not like periods on to say we don't want to talk about them you guys need to talk about them so that you guys can make them normal in your life because they're already normal in our lives and we don't feel that they are a secret or something to hide they're just normal things that we go through but men want to hide it and don't want you to talk about it or i i don't know i just don't like that because i'm a high believer like i believe that these should also be free you know so yeah i don't like that even when like i'm at the pharmacy this other day i was buying um period pain uh neurofins period pain and um i was so i was with my husband and then the pharmacist i said to the pharmacist um can i please also have a pack of neurofin period pains oh and then he says to me the pink box then i say neurofin's period pains then he goes the pink box then my husband says yes the pink box then i go no neurofin period pains and then he's like okay then he moves to go take it then my husband says i think he didn't want to say um like period pains then i'm like but that's what they are like that's what they are that's how when you buy them because also neurofins come for back pains and all these other pains you should specify that you want the ones that are period pains why must we say it and they don't say it why must men be scared of saying periods when we so calmly can say periods i mean my young cousins yeah so that was my story of time anyway let's continue And then we've got Epsom salt and Himalayan salt with Franklin sands and what to, ela, ela. to restore calm and serenity amidst modern life. Ooh, with added CBD oil. La, la, la. I'm here for this. You know, it relaxes um, mind and body for clarity of the mind promotes tranquility i am all for this it's going to be our first time trying it but already from the packaging it makes me feel like i'm gonna love it and then i've got these uh collagen under eye situation because like i tend to get dark dark under my eyes so we need to stop that or help hydrate our under eyes And then, um, oh, save water. Waps. I love waps. This, these are for my bag. Okay. The other day I was talking about wipes and I, I used my husband's oxy. That he chose the wipes this time, but hey, those ones, no, no, no. They don't have enough moisture and they don't feel like they're hydrating your skin. It feels like they're hurting your skin because like they're not that soft. So I got these ones. I know these ones are value for money. They hydrate you. They last longer. They're just perfect for me. And another tub. Ooh. Wait. I'll, I'll, I'll end with that one. And this. 
uh so i got these two where's the other one so these were 120 together and 90 rand each so it's 90 rand 90 rand and 120 for two so it was a nice special day at flex and then last but not least that's chocolate i love uh lint white chocolate guys it's smooth Ugh, the center is like soft Ugh, it's everything this is by far my favorite chocolate i love ps i love white chocolate a lot but like this lint white chocolate is just something else it's really nice but that's it for my um clicks haul thank you so much for watching Mwah. Thank you.